one thing that I do do, do do, which helps a lot of people in terms of their, um, in the way that they create more content from limited amount of input from themselves, right? So the way I look at things is, um, if I'm gonna sit and write a 20 minute post, that's a lot of my time to write one post. But if I could write four posts in 20 minutes or six posts in 20 minutes, that would be much better. Now the way you can use ChatGPT is to create a bunch of prompts that will output a given post in multiple tones of voice and multiple styles and it usually works well for business profiles, better than personal profiles. If you're trying to get it to write stuff for a personal profile, it can be really hard to get that tone of voice right um, for that person or for yourself. But for a business account, well, you've probably already got brand guidelines, a tone of voice, and it is a little bit less personable. People expect when you're putting out a personal post to be adding your experience, your projects, your past experience, your knowledge, your thoughts, your chat GPT can't do all that. What it can do is take what you give it and put a different spin on it. So sometimes what I will do is I'll create a post around a video where it's me talking like this on a specific point. And then I'll get it to create a version of that that I post without the video. So it becomes a text post. Now that is achievable. Right, and in all it requires is a couple more minutes of me going back over the top again and looking for words that I wouldn't say or phrases that I wouldn't say or layout that I don't like and correcting it. There's no harm in doing that. And that will go down as well as your original content or if not better. 